Hey guys, it's Jason. I'm going to be doing a video on how I distress my jeans. And the pairs that I'm going to be using are uh, this pair of Cheap Mondays. This pair of 501 Levi's that I thrifted. I got them during um, the President's Day sale at Goodwill. It was like $3 for old clothing. You don't want to ruin a $60 pair of jeans. You'd rather just, or I would rather just distress like a pair of jeans I got from Goodwill or a thrift store. One thing that I don't show me doing in the video is sewing this patch on the leg of my jeans only because I don't know how to sew myself so I had my mom do it for me but um, for those part I show like what I usually do another tip that I have would be just cutting lines and then washing and drying it because that kind of frays it more than doing it by hand you can always do it by hand but it'll just be more destroyed if you just wash and dry it so what you're going to need are a pair of jeans you want to distress an exacto knife a hard surface you don't mind scratching and a pair of tweezers. So what I like to do is just cut lines across my jeans to kind of map out where I wanted to stress. Then I take my tweezers and I start pulling at the white fibers from the opposite side of the jeans. If you turn it over, you'll be able to see what I'm talking about. I usually just pull them down and that kind of frays them more so both lines will connect together and there'll be frayed lines between the two parts that I cut. You can also pull the fibers once they're large enough to create bigger holes. I also like to stab my exacto knife along in one row, it kind of creates this really skinny line of distressing. I can distress the pockets as well as the front of the jeans, it just makes an overall better look. Um, let me know down below which look was your favorite of the two and make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. I'll leave the links to my Twitter, Instagram, and Tumblr below. And yeah, thanks for watching.